So now that a lot of us are going back to work or going back to school, I'm sure we are all faced with the problem of how to look chic and put together, especially when we are in a rush. I feel like ever since I became a mom, this is even more a reality for me in my everyday life where I want to look good and put together and like I have things under control, but I don't have a lot of time to spend on putting together a really well thought out outfit or doing anything with my hair or doing a full face of makeup. So I wanted to share with you my top tips and tricks on how you can look chic and stylish and put together even when you are in a rush. All of these things take little to no time and will make your life so much easier. Before I hop into the video, I quickly wanted to thank Ana Luisa for sponsoring this portion of the video. I have been wearing their pieces for the last couple of years and I truly, truly love their pieces so, so much. I'm pretty confident that I have Ana Luisa pieces all over me right now because they are genuinely pieces that I wear on a daily basis, such as these bracelets that I have, these rings. So I wanted to show you a few of the new pieces that I recently picked up. I have been eyeing these twisted rope earrings and ring for a while and I am so happy to finally have them in my collection because I truly think they are so special. There is a simple elegance to them and they look beautiful on their own or stacked with other earrings. Jewelry has always been my go-to for looking chic when I'm in a rush because it highlights your face and really completes a look. I also recently received these gold hoops in this rectangular shape with rounded edges and I've been wearing them every single day. I think they are so cool. So what I love most about Ana Luisa is that all of their pieces are designed and handcrafted with the highest quality recycled materials. Their pieces are tarnish free and long lasting and because of their direct to consumer mission, they are able to keep their operations carbon neutral and offer sustainable luxury jewelry at affordable prices. This is one of the reasons I partnered with them to create my very own earrings you see here that is now one of their best sellers. To shop Ana Luisa and for links to all the pieces I mentioned, check my description box below. Ana Luisa also always runs discounts on their website, so be sure to check that out as well. So the first tip I wanted to share with you is to focus on minimal makeup. This sounds counterintuitive, but I personally find that especially when you are in a rush, not only is applying minimal makeup a lot more time efficient, but in my personal opinion, I feel like a minimal, clean, fresh look looks a lot better than a full face of makeup. Over the last couple of years, I have really kind of doubled down on my makeup routine and my skincare routine and the amount of products that I apply to my skin I've really narrowed it down and I only use the bare essentials so for me it's always some kind of a tinted moisturizer just to even out my skin tone and then I'll add a little bit of concealer under my eyes I will fill in my brows a little bit add in a little bit of brow gel bronzer blush and that's pretty much it I feel like everything else on top of that is optional if you want to add a little bit of mascara or a little bit of a lip balm. But in my opinion, if you wanna look fresh and chic, I think when your natural skin imperfections show through your makeup, it looks a lot more natural and it saves a lot of time. So another thing that I like to do when I want to look chic in a rush and especially when I am having a really bad hair day is just to throw all of my hair into a low bun. I feel like a low bun always looks super chic and sophisticated and I have this special way of making my buns in less than like 10 or 20 seconds and I feel like this method can work on most hair types and hair lengths and you need very minimal tools to achieve it. So what I like to do is gather all of my hair to the back and start tying a ponytail and on the last loop, I will loop my hair through 
through the scrunchie about an inch or two and whatever loose hair I have left, I twist it and wrap it around the base of the ponytail. And I do this until I have no more hair to work with. And with the last one or two inches of hair, I'll kind of wrap it through the scrunchie so it stays in place. And then I'll take the twisted part of my hair and wrap it over the little bun that I created to cover up the scrunchie and any other flyaway hairs. And usually I just keep it like this, but if you do also have a lot of hair or heavy hair, it also helps to secure it with a couple of bobby pins. And this literally takes me a few seconds to do, and I feel like it looks so chic and so good, so stylish, and it's a perfect solution for when you are in a rush. So whenever I am cramped for time and I don't have the time to put together a well-planned out outfit, I just reach for a dress. I feel like dresses are no brainers. They take the guesswork out of dressing yourself. And I feel like they look so chic and so beautiful, especially a flowy dress. And there are so many ways that you can style a flowy dress throughout the seasons. So if you are in the spring and summer months, you can easily just throw on a sandal with it. Or if you are in the middle of the fall or winter months, you can easily pair it with a boot and it's going to look so, so good. Another tip that I wanted to share with you guys is to go for a structured handbag. I find that with a lot of handbags that have more of a slouchy boho feel, it kind of makes an outfit look more casual and dressed down and a little bit sloppy depending on the design of the handbag. So anytime I'm trying to dress myself up and look a little bit more chic and put together, even if I'm wearing a t-shirt and jeans, I feel like just adding in a structured handbag automatically elevates it and it's just such an easy accessory to add to your look. An element that I think completely transforms a look and it can instantly make it look a lot more chic is any garment, whether it's a dress or a top or a t-shirt that has shoulder pads. Shoulder pads not only add structure to your look, but it just makes even the most simplest basics look more elevated and put together. One of my favorite items to wear with shoulder pads are blazers. It's another really easy add-on that you can use to make yourself look more stylish and put together when you are in a rush. And it's another thing that instantly dresses up something as simple as a t-shirt and jeans. So when I am in a rush, I want to make sure that the things that I'm pulling from my closet are going to look and fit me really, really well. So that's why for me, tailoring is so, so important. I have several pieces in my closet that are tailored tailored specifically to my height and my body shape that I took to a tailor. So I know whenever I want to look chic in a hurry, I will just throw on these pieces and not even think twice about it. So I know it's a little bit more costly to spend money on tailoring, but I promise you it's going to make all the difference in the world. And the way that I see it is that it's an investment into my wardrobe. And I only tailor pieces that I know I'm going to have in my closet for many, many, many years to come. A super easy way to make any outfit look so much more chic, especially when you're in a hurry, is just to tuck in your top into your bottoms. It literally takes a couple of seconds, but it makes all the difference in the world, whether you do a full tuck or a French tuck, or you leave a little bit of your shirt hanging out and you have the other side tucked in. It always looks so much more chic and stylish when you do some kind of a tuck with your shirt. It also gives your frame more shape, so it's usually a lot more flattering than just leaving your shirt hanging out of your pants. So if you don't have time for any of the other things that I suggested in this video, just tucking your shirt into your bottoms can really make such a huge difference. So when I am in a rush, one of the things that I avoid putting on my body is any fabrics that are more prone to wrinkling, such as linen, which is a beautiful fabric, but unfortunately the nature of linen likes to wrinkle. So I try to avoid it because I know that I'm going to have to take 
take the extra time to steam it. I know that there is a much higher chance that it's going to wrinkle throughout the day. So if I know that I'm going somewhere where I'm going to be moving around a lot or sitting a lot and it's going to cause that fabric to wrinkle, I will avoid wearing those items because if they do end up wrinkling throughout the day, it's just going to make my overall look look a lot less put together. Another one of my go-to tricks to making my outfit look a lot more chic when I am in a rush is to throw on a top that has a high neck. There's just something about having a little bit of fabric covering your neck, whether it's a mock neck like this or a high neck or a turtleneck that kind of adds a more sophisticated vibe to a look without even really having to think about it. This is also a style that you can wear all year round, whether you are in the spring or summer, you can just wear something that doesn't have sleeves or in the fall and winter months, you can throw on a turtleneck sweater or a knit sweater with a higher neck and it's instantly going to make your look appear a lot more put together. Another really easy accessory to add on to your look if you are in a hurry and you're trying to look really chic and stylish is just to throw on a pointed toe shoe. So if you are working in an office, you can easily throw on a pair of pumps or if you are going to school or if you're going to a workplace or some kind of an environment where you have to be on your feet for a long period of time, throwing on a pointed toe flat or maybe something with a kitten heel is a really easy way to transform your look and make it appear like you put some thought into it or some effort into it. Pointed toe shoes are such an essential in my wardrobe and that's because they are a no-brainer. It really takes the guesswork out of what to put on your feet when you are in a rush and they also mix and match really really well with a ton of different looks. Okay guys so that wraps up today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought about this video in the comments below and if there's anything that you go to to make yourself feel a lot more chic when you are in a rush let me know in the comments if you like this video please be sure to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and with that i want to thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me as always and i will see you in my next one